Hi, I'm Pedro Lage. I'm an artist and Duke University professor, and I'm the creator of the Art of the MOOC series. The previous two courses in the series were produced with Creative Time in New York and were on the topics of public art and pedagogy, as well as activism and social movements. We are now very excited to share with you this third course on experiments with sound. The course was designed with composer and professor Matthias Hinke, and it's a partnership with the University of the Fine Arts in Berlin. Hi, my name is Matthias Hinke. I'm a composer and a professor at the University of the Arts in Berlin. I write music for all sorts of ensembles and orchestras, but I also focus a lot on writing music for people without any musical background. You will learn in this course not just historical and theoretical aspects of the production of sound, acoustic phenomena, and contemporary composition, but also you will have the opportunity to make your own experiments with sound. In addition to composer Matthias Hinke and myself, you will have two other co-teachers. Hello, my name is J.S. Clayton. I'm a musician. Some people know me for my work as DJ Rupture, and I most recently wrote a book called Uproot, Travels in 21st Century Music and Digital Culture. Hi everyone, I'm Candace Hopkins. I work as an independent curator and a writer. Two examples of projects I've worked on is one called Sagahan, which took place in 2013 at the National Gallery of Canada, which was a survey of recent Indigenous art. Another is working as curator of Documenta 14, which is an international exhibition that for the 14th edition of Documenta took place in both Athens, Greece and Kassel, Germany. Experiments with Sound covers a very broad approach. It's designed both as an introductory course, but also as a course that lets you explore really unexpected angles uh, when it comes to music and sound. We have both conventional, what now have become canonical figures of composition, like John Cage and his empty words, or Alvin Lucier's I, I am, sitting am Sitting in a Room. room. Different from the one you are in now. They are calling sound in speaking voice. But we also have phenomena that belong in the social sphere. For example, the grunting that tennis players make when they hit a ball on the court. Or the sound of fan clubs as they are in the stadium. Contemporary composers are making compositions for all kinds of settings, like a harbor where the sound of horns becomes the instrument in the orchestration. Or music made specifically for airplanes. Some other composers, like Cornelius Cardew, wanted to work with everyday participants, you know, and sound producers. So he created the now famous scratch orchestras. In New York City, there has been an environment that for decades has not changed, and it's called the Dream House. We will also study the history of experimental notation systems, even musical instruments that have been built from objects that were left across the U.S.-Mexico border by undocumented immigrants. From the beauty of Quranic recitation, to the use of autotunes in the work of Moroccan wedding singer Hafida. Or, the experimental distribution of a new work by hip-hop star Kanye West in different public spaces around the world, challenging commodification. Last but not least, Experiments with Sound includes guest presentations by a range of artists, composers, activists, and scholars who bring their own backgrounds to this very rich conversation. An air horn orchestra protesting discriminatory law a record player you can make with cardboard and a nail. The influence of black music and its sounds on global culture. A metal ensemble playing music in a garage. People discovering the hidden sounds of electromagnetic waves. Chicks on speed performing over data visualization. 
research projects on auditory architecture and urban planning, a database art memorial for all black men killed by police in the United States. A lecture delivered with a rock band while playing the drums. And a computational opera that is never performed the same way. So we hope you will join us.